Hey folks, this is Chris from John Hunt Wild. I want to talk to you about something that's very near and dear to me. Uh, it's still a little bit early in the season. I'm getting to the point where you can't really do it. If you haven't started, so I'll start within the next two weeks or else it's probably not going to be, things aren't going to come to fruition. The thing that's near and near, dear to me is gardening, vegetable gardening. I love doing it. Um, I have the same green beans that I've had for nine years. I grow them, I take the seeds, and then I grow them again. <clears throat> and they're starting to look kind of different from store-bought uh, green beans, which is kind of cool. Little game in uh, Mandelian genetics there. Uh, but yeah, it's getting kind of late in the season up here in Illinois, because in northern Illinois we kind of have a short and growth season. It was very cold this uh, this spring. Usually I start on May 20th or before. After May 20th, it's safe. There's no frost. Uh, that's from my experience. The Farmer's Almanac says May 5th, and the seed packets say April 20th, but I know better. It's May 20th for the growing season around here, at least. Um, but, yeah, if you have uh, the land and if you have the time, well, not even time, you can make time. Just if you have the land, you will never regret putting in a garden. It's probably one of the most relaxing things in the world, just being out there. We're just going out there every night and watering them. And around here, um, since the soil is so over-farmed and it's been farmed for about 200 years now, uh, what I do is I just dig out a hole where I'm going to plant. You know, of course, I turn over all the soil to get rid of the weeds and to aerate it. But I just wind up digging a hole and putting peat moss in there. Just regular peat moss in the plant, and then on top some of the soil so nutrients can drain down, and I just water it like crazy. Um, but yeah, that's just something, not a really heavy topic, just something light. But if you, I just tell you guys, if you've never had a garden before, if you, if only if you have like six or seven plants, just vegetables or what, if you grow it, you will not, you will never, even if it's stuff you don't like. I don't particularly like green beans or eggplants, but I always plant them just because they look cool. Um, and some of the reasons it's almost ornamental. They just look so cool, you know, red cabbage and stuff like that. Uh, and corn, which is a tropical plant, which is cool. Well, the, the version that we grow is tropical. There was, was corn up here, indigenously grown. But, uh, yeah, you'll you'll never regret it. So... Just wanted to send that out there on YouTube. Not everything has to be a debate, right? <laughs>